Hey, good morning, Facebook and YouTube. Well, oh, where's my camera gone? Fuck, you're looking at the ceiling. Hi, look at the very sexy one coin ceiling. Did you like that? That was pretty cool, wasn't it? Welcome once again to One Coin Only. Thank you very much for coming in. There's my sexy ceiling. Now you know what my whole freaking house looks like. Uh, guys, we are going to be doing our first episode of Whatever Wednesday. Another big week this week. Lots and lots of requests. Thank you very much for getting involved. Don't forget, if you also want to make a Whatever Wednesday request, you can become a supporter by clicking on the green shield. Something to think about. Uh, I'm going to say hello to everyone in the room. We've got Oliver over on YouTube. Good to see you as always, my man. Thank you for coming in. And uh, over on Facebook, we've got Marco, Jared, Alex, James. We've got Meander. How you doing? Meowdy do, I should say. Good to see you, man. Yeah, thank you so much for coming in. We got Kitty Cat in here. We got uh, we got Mike, James, Chris, uh, Jared, Lauren, Nick, Nick with the Boston Cream presented. There we go. I, I need a Boston Cream. I can't even begin to tell you the last time I had one. I think I'm getting some serious withdrawals right now. Good to see you, Nick. We got Ryan, Jared as well. Thank you so much for coming in. Well, um, with that being said, we're going to get started straight away. So our first request is for Antonio. Now I have to sort of do a random lottery to make it fair. And uh, poor Antonio, I don't know if he's awake now, but uh, yeah, he's first off the rank. So, I mean, I'm sure he'll like the replay regardless. So, I'm just going to do a few holes of Neo Turf Masters. We're loading up uh, the, the PlayStation 2 emulator this time. I own this game physically, no, nothing illegal going on here. And uh, yeah, it just works better on this than the arcade emulator. So, we're just going to find where Neo Turf Masters is. Here we are. How you going, Mikey? Good to see you. are going to be on the 10 p.m. show with your missus, brother. Hey, Lamont. Lamont, thank you. Lamont dropping a big 100 stars. Lamont, this is for you. You will go flying over that top rope, Paul Heyman. Oh, Heyman. <laughs> thank you so much, man. Uh, you, you, when you said what's up, you just reminded me of R-Truth when he said what's up, you know. And no, that's okay, Lamont. You literally came in like two seconds after we started. Oh, here we go. Antonio is in here. Good to see you, man. And then we got uh, we got uh, Dustin in here. He's multitasking. Cool, cool. D Wayne says the universe is in balance. Earthworm Jim has been requested. D Wayne, see, I'm a good brother. I took it this week, and we got the shitty Master System version today. Oh, we get. Don't don't let Joseph hear me say that. Hey, you going, Robert? Good to see you. Nobody ever cares. Good to see you. Or... Yeah, man, this is such a great golf game. Who should I pick? I'm going to pick Mr. Young. I'm going to pick the balanced guy here. Oh, we're going to fucking do some golf in Australia, mate. Let's go. Put another shrimp on the barbie. Let's go. Right, some golf. Oh, here we go. Joseph is in here. Whoops. <laughs> Joseph is on YouTube. There you go, D-Wayne. Joseph heard us. All right, hole number one. You're not sure what was your request again, Sean, and I will let you know. Uh, yeah, um... I may have missed you, Sean, for some reason, but if you message me later on today, I will, I will sneak in for you, brother. But yeah, I think I accidentally missed you for whatever reason, man, so send me another message, and I'll bump you into t uh, later tonight. That's no problem. If you can do that for me, Sean. No, that's okay. Sean, Sean, let me know. What are we going to do? Hang on. What, we got 140 yards? Oh, there we go. Come on, we're going to get this summit. Come on, on the green, mate. On the green. Get on this, some bitch. All right, just tap it in. Just a tap, tap, tap a -roo. You see, Wayne says last night your game's not on his list. Uh, let me just double check. Oh, my God. Justin, give me a sec. Hang on. Maybe, I don't know, I thought I'd put you on D-Wayne's list. Hang on one second, Justin. Yeah, Frogger on Super Nintendo. You are on D-Wayne's list. Wasn't that your request this week, Justin? Or is that a different Justin? I thought you had Frogger on Super Nintendo. Yeah, no, I understand that. You messaged about me about it yesterday. Yeah, I Frogger on Super Nintendo, I put in D-Wayne's list. Lauren says, who's got you? Oh my goodness. Uh, let me have a look, Lauren. Lauren, I think... Uh... Oh, 
I can't see, man, right now. Lauren, what was your request again? And I'll have a look. I'll have a look for you, brother. Oh, damn it. Every, every... What was your request again, Lauren? No, that's all right. As, as I said, guys, I, I might have to change the format of whatever Wednesday. I feel like lately I'm making a lot of mistakes. They're, they're not deliberate. It's just obviously with the excess volume and uh, the constant people messaging me. Some message just must be getting lost in the shuffle. Oh, that was close. Oh, Wildcats. No, I gave that to D-Wayne. Hang on. Yeah, no, you're on D-Wayne's list. That's right. I was wondering where that was. That's all good. Yeah, you're on D-Wizard's list, bro. Jared says, well, okay, guys, you, 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 just, you, just let me play the game. I've got, like, 50 names here. I can't keep finding everybody. What, again, if you want to know where your game is on the list, it's easier to let me know by game, because it's easy to find the, uh, get the, oh, my God. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. All right, let's go. Let's just smack this in. How you going, Rick? Good to see you. Thank you for coming in. Hope you're doing good. Right, I want everyone to make a request, but man, I just... It's its, it's getting a bit crazy, isn't it? It's, it is starting to get a bit crazy. Oh, damn, I missed. How you going, Sylvain? Good to see you. Let's have a quick look for Jared. Uh, you're, you're on D-Wayne's list, Jared, just so you know. A new Pokemon puzzle game called Pokemon Cafe for Nintendo Switch. Is it Pokemon Cafe? So what's that all going to be about? How you going there, Johnny? Good to see you. Thank you for coming in. No, that's okay, but Mikey, don't, 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 don't you start getting, uh, don't you start getting cheeky there, Mikey. <laughs> Hey you go, we got Captain VS. I'm glad you came in, man. Thanks for hanging out. You're going to be third on the list, sir, so I'm glad you're awake. So, hi, one says, by the way, you're driving to get your banana French toast and some OJ. So, whereabouts do you like to get that from, if I may ask? Well, where's, where's Good Tea and Joyzy? No, so Jared says you stink at golf games. I, I'm really, really looking forward to 2K golf. Like, that, that's going to be, like, my main sort of, like, um... I think that'll be my main like late night stream once that comes out. I'm super super keen. I don't, I just hope it does well. Like uh, I, yeah man, I'm super super keen. Oh in the hole, bruh. We got this cunt in the. Ho oh no! <laughs> I kind of screwed that one up, Antonio. You're not making it easy for me, is it? Hey, you going there, Ian? Good to see you. Thank you for coming in today. And then D-Wayne says plumbers don't wear ties as a fake... Well, you could say it's a... Yeah. So where's Jeff? And uh, so Dustin says, holy crap, a new Pokemon Snap game for Pokemon Snap game for the Switch. Oh, so it's like Pokemon Snap. Oh, hey, I really liked Pokemon Snap. If we're getting a new one, I'm super, super keen. So is there a headwind? There is. I don't think I can hit over. I think I'm gonna have to lay up. Uh, yeah, we, we, we might we might go with the four iron here and spray and pray. Let's go. Lay the sunbish up. Let's go one coin. Lay her up. Well, that sounds like a nice place. There's nothing better than a decent diner. Hey. All right. So 220. Oh man, just okay. There's a little bit of a headwind on this sunbish. Oh, I might it might need a bit of a rollback, but that's okay. Uh, a little bit hot. Hey, we got the bomb in here, dude. Thank you so much. Big shout out to oh goodness. Hang on one second, you crazy sunbish. What are you doing? Oh damn. The <laughs> bomb. Thank you, brother. And Jeff has um just dropped a thousand. Fucking Jeff, you didn't need to do that, bro. This is going out to you. 
We're gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna start a dance party for Jeff. Once again, a massive, massive shout out going out to Xbit Gaming, guys. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Oh, dude, how was the rest of your Resident Evil stream? Guys, don't forget to check out Xbit Gaming. You guys know I'm already talking about them all the time in here. Uh, good brothers and sisters is our guys. You can see we've got Manus Gaming Fest in here right now in the room. we got Jeff. You've got uh, Ian always visiting. You've got Viper doing the Resident Evil. A massive team over there. You've got Dozy. You've got Brett. Just to name a few. Check them out, guys. And, uh, oh, yeah, we better get back into the game, hey? Sorry about that. I just stopped the whole show for you, Jeff. <laughs> Thank you, man. Really appreciate the thousand stars this morning, brother. I'm, uh... Well, let's just smack this golf ball in. This is a really great game. I have done a whole 18 holes before, Randy. I love this game. Alright, there we go. So let's, let's do another few holes. Sandra, good morning. Good to see you today. Thank you for hanging out. Uh, yeah, good. Well, happy hump day, everybody. They call it Happy Hump Day, but you know, every, every 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 time like I hear Hump Day, I chuckle like a naughty 16-year-old. Because, you know, I'm just very immature like that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright, so what, what do we got? A hundred. Alright, we can do this. Ah, oh, no, it's a little bit hot again, Rick. He's a bit off his game today. He's up, Turbo. He's up. On the green it is. You can get this on the PS2 as part of the SNK Classics collection. That's how I own it. Uh, the easy, easiest way to get Or you can, No, actually, hang on. You can actually get this on the Nintendo Switch and the PS4 for about 10 bucks, I think. This is, this is going to be a bogey, I think. This is not good. Get in there, you sunbitch! Oh, okay, we, we parted. It's fine. I feel like hump days kind of died down a bit. You think it, we need a Fergie my hump script? Well, you know what? Black Eyed Peas my humps. Let me write that down. My humps. For whatever Wednesday. There you go. I wrote down my humps. That's, a, that's, a, that's an idea, Lamont. It's an idea. Fergie's lovely lady lumps. Check it out. Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna smack this of them here. Come on, Rick Dog. Big shot, mate. Big shot. So, so Ian says he's looking forward to seeing Star Wars Bunk Bounty Hunter. Dude, I don't, um... I, I don't know, man. Like, I've never played it before. I do not know what to expect. I don't know if it's any good or not, to be honest. It'll be interesting. Who asked for Bounty Hunter today? That was Adam's request, wasn't it? I, I hope, hopefully it's a good game. We're gonna, um... Yeah, I haven't played many of the PS2 Star Wars games really. Oh, dude. Sit, Ubu. Sit. Good dog, Rock. I know it's okay, man, yeah? yeah? How are your Monster Hunter streams been going lately, by the way, girl? That's gonna get in. Get in there! Sit, Ubu. Sit. Alright, well, let's, uh, let's smack, a, smack another hole, huh? All right, well, we're two under. So, so what do we got now? Hole number eight. All right, well, that's perfect. We could we could do two more holes, and that'll be the front nine, and then we'll move on. How's that sound? All right, so what are we gonna do? We're gonna we're gonna. It's a little bit of a headwind on this, so a little bit, little bit. The headwind should carry us on, hopefully. Oh, you son of a fuck! Well, that that that, that my theory just goes straight up the freaking butt, doesn't it? Yeah. Hi, you know what? We got a headwind. That's all good, everybody. I got a headwind. And then you know what I did? I did a freaking Thelma and Louise, bro. I just totally did Thelma and Louise. I love you, Thelma. I love you, Louise. We're going to fall down the hole. Oh, my goodness. Oh, brah. All right. Okay. Oh, shit. I hate the yeah, That was tough. That, that, was, that was tough going, mate. That's all right. This is good. <laughs> it just went in the Grand Canyon, mate. Oh, dude. Yeah, that that was that wasn't pleasant. That was rough. 
All right, here we go. We got one lucky last hole. I'm usually pretty good at this game. A little bit of a rough run today. But what are you going to do? That's going to take us back to even. Don't forget to smash the like button if you can, please, guys. Thank you very much. Oh, gosh. All right, one more. <laughs> All right, this is the last hole, and then we're going to have to move on. The next game is a quick run of Kung Fu for Kevin. Just a quick 10-minute run. We already did that yesterday. It's a bit of deja vu. And, um, all right, we've got smack, smack, smack my bishop right here. Remember the prodigy? You think I'll go par? Well, I'm hoping we can birdie this one, Menya. Hey, Jessup, good morning to you as well. Thank you for coming in. I'm hoping we can par this. Come on, par it, Rick. What? Well, okay, in you go, mate. Oh, he's he's up to. Oh, get in there, you. Okay, this is a birdie. This is totally a birdie. Birdie try. There we are. Tap her in, mate. That's what's up, party people. That's what's up. Yeah, power draw. Lee Cavello's what putting challenge? That's the one. <laughs> Oh, man, I love this game, but I'm going to have to get out of it before I get hooked. Antonio, what a great warm-up to the day. Thank you very, very much. That is Neo Turf Master. You're going to see that game a lot more on the channel. That is a really, really fun golf game, whether you're into golf or not. That game is incredible. And uh, what a nice way to start the stream. We're just going to do a quick loop of Kung Fu now. This is going out to Kevin. We're going to try and do this with no deaths. You think I should do a Prodigy star screen as well? You know what? I'd, do, I'd totally do Smack My Bitch Up. But if I did Smack My Bitch Up as a thank you screen, uh, I would get thrown off Facebook because that's like sex, drugs, and rock and roll, basically. <laughs> I don't know if you've seen it. Yeah, Mikey, I've seen the new Star Wars Squadrons. Um, I don't I mean... It depends what the gameplay is like. Uh, because, I mean, the idea of flying an X-Wing is freaking awesome, obviously. Um, but I recently did Star Wars Battlegrounds, and I mean, if it's the same mechanics as that, I think it might get a bit repetitive after a while. But, uh, I'll wait and see. I mean, it, it does intrigue me. I, I just, I just don't know if I'll get Squadron Jet. But am I interested? Yeah, sure. Mario Golf is out. Man, Mario Golf is freaking sweet. We need a new Mario Golf game on the Switch. Definitely. How you going there, Jay? Good to see you. And Josh says you want me to come to your wedding? Where, whereabouts is your wedding and when is your wedding, by the way? Once again, a big congratulations, Josh. Breathe. Yeah, breathe is, breathe is a classic, isn't it? What the fuck is this? Man, the pro yeah. Oh, gosh. Hey, we got Perry in here. Big shout out to our friends of the Global Stream Machine as well. Man, I, lo I love me some Kung Fu. Like, I know I've probably played this game almost as much as any on the channel, but it's just a it's just a, a, a just a simple game to just kill some time, hey? Jared says you've already pre-ordered it. You're a big Star Wars nut. <sighs> yeah, man, I'm, I'm, I, look, I'm interested. As I said, I just... It, you know, it, EA. Let's just, let's just put it that way, EA. I, I know EA have got potential to be great again, but they've got some work to do. How you going there, Daniel? Good to see you. Thanks for coming in, man. I hope you're having a great morning. Oh, gosh. Deep breath, Rick. Yeah, I love me some Kung Fu. After this, we got Donkey Kong Country for Captain BS. Um, dude, I... I mean, we should, we should be getting to get past a good few levels in that today, I would think. Well, I'm starting, you know, nice little warm-up here. I'll be confident. As I said, this is going to get us a little bit ahead of schedule because we only need to do one loop of this. Kevin, I hope you're enjoying. This, this is a very, very special shout-out to Kevin. We just want to thank uh, Kevin as one of, uh, one of many people here that make the dream possible. Thank you for everything you do, sir. <clears throat> you went to the app crashed I was having that problem I updated and then it was fine uh yeah there's some pretty decent yeah it's it's not too bad um I don't want to be overly judgmental in some of the games on the um 10 p.m stream just because there's a lot of there might be a lot of surprises on that because there's a lot of games I haven't played before 
Daniel, thank you very much, dude. Daniel dropping a big 100 stars. What can we give to Daniel today? Oh, you know what? There you go, a little bit of nostalgia there. Thank you so much, Daniel. Big 100. <clears throat> and we got Alexis in here as well. Oh my gosh. I really, as I said, I know I keep complaining about this all the time. I really need someone to come and crack my back. I think, I think, you know, I don't, I don't get like a massage or see a back specialist often, but when I do, they get so many cracks out of my back, I think I freak them out. I, I don't think it's human. <laughs> and then Patrick says, D Ricky D, have a cake, throw in a break, dancing D Wayne. Uh, oh, dude, Patrick, thank you, man. Patrick has just dropped a massive 750 stars as well. Are you, you're treating me like, you know, speaking of joys, are you treating me like Silvio's favorite girl, mate? And a uh, big thank you for making me feel like Silvio's favorite girl. You know, you're making me feel like Silvio's bottom bitch today. Just going by the South Park episode. I didn't know what a bottom bitch was until I saw South Park. But you know, the more you know, hey? <laughs> Patrick, thank you very much for the 750 stars. What are we going to give to Patrick? We're going to give you this one. Well, and a big toast to the whole Sunbish Army too. Well, excuse me, princess. Well, excuse you want, you, oh wait, you want some breakdancing D-Wayne? Of course, oh, there you go. Can't touch this. We're gonna do the crotch chopping D-Wayne too. Can't touch this. Ian says massage with or without a happy ending. Oh, there we go, the happy ending. I genuinely need a back massage, Ian. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh my gosh, well hot, oh no, Jared wants to see a hot dog dance. All right, guys, I do apologize. Everyone's going a bit wild here. All right. <clears throat> All right, here we go. Uh, stretching, stretching, just getting ready. It's a bit early in the morning for this. Ready? I'm a hot dog. I'm a hot dog. Look at me. Look at me. Thank you, Jared. Jared with the big uh, 500 stars as well. Everybody party! Oh my goodness. Jared, thank you so much, dude. <laughs> Him and Como and their massage. Not that type of massage, guys. Yes, yes, we all know happy ending massages exist. And let's pretend as men that they're not freaking awesome. But no, that's not what I want to get. I want to get a back massage because I've been sitting non-stop in this chair for eight months and my back feels like a freaking chair. And I need to get my posture right. You know what I was actually thinking of getting, and I'm not even kidding, I was thinking of get you might have seen them on the internet. I was thinking of getting one of those posture belts, you know those posture belts that tighten up your back? I was actually thinking of getting one of those, because I've totally got Nintendo back from when I was 8 years old. <laughs> uh, hey, how you going, Hope? Yes, yeah, so for some reason people decide- I, I harmlessly said I wanted to get a back massage and some bitches are making it into something else, mate. You said my back here. <laughs> oh gosh, there we go. Kevin, thank you very much. Short and sweet, but there we go. Thomas saved the girls, gonna get the nookie. Hey, good morning, Mel. Thank you for coming in. Hope you're doing great. The happiness does not continue long. Well, that sucks. Well, unlucky for you guys. Lucky I'm not in that relationship. Thank you very much, Kevin. That was a very quick run of Kung Fu. And uh, we're going to move on to... Um, where's our streaming folder? We need to do Donkey Kong Country. And uh, hopefully this will turn out all right. I haven't done... Oh, okay, I needed... Oh, so this has been a little bit rom hacky at the moment. Where's Donkey Kong Country at? Oh, that's probably the problem. I think I'm in the wrong folder. What a, what a dickhead. What are you doing, Rick? Donkey Kong... Here we go. There it is. Hey, good morning, Alan. Thank you very much for coming in. Marcus has just dropped a big 200 stars. Marcus, thank you. Marcus says, what's up, Rick Dog? Just dropping some love uh, before your doctor's appointment. Marcus, please let us know um, how it all goes. Not your private details, man. But, you know, I just want to make sure that you're healthy and happy, sir. This is for you. you 
Thank you, man. You take care of yourself. Good luck at the docks, huh? We got, we got, good morning to Steve. Hello, governor. And so Jared says he went to get a milkshake at Wendy's Milk Bar on Monday. See, what people in the United States don't realize is we have Wendy's over here, but it's not burgers or anything. It's just milkshakes and ice cream. Oh, I got you. Yeah, basically at Wendy's over here, all you get is hot dogs and ice cream. It's a completely different company. And, uh, alright, well, let's, um... I'm just gonna go back to the beginning, I guess. Hang on, let me reset. Sorry, I'm gonna start from the beginning because it's been so long since I've played. Daniel dropping 190 again. Daniel! What are we gonna give to Daniel this time? Some Okay, here we go. We got this for you, man. Dude, that's incredible. Thank you so much. Daniel's really, really excited for this one. I, I feel like, dude, I've got big shoes to fill now, man. Like, there's a lot of people that love Donkey Kong Country. Hey, I, I like Donkey Kong Country uh, just fine. It doesn't like me all that much always, though. It's it's kind of a a, a bit of a sumbish. Alright, so I'm, try I'm trying to find the right sale save five. God, hang on. I just need to... Get my focus here. Why, why is this controller not working now? Okay, down here. Donkey Kong for D-Wayne. Nah, I've, jumped, jumped. I've, I've given D-Wayne enough tough games this week. I need to do some of them myself too. You, you do realize that D-Wayne... I, I, I can't keep picking on D-Wayne with the hard requests. I feel like I've already been enough of a bastard this week. I, I've got to do some of them too. Oh... <clears throat> And, uh, so, so down, why, down, down, why? What happens when you do that? Oh, good to see you, Austin. I don't know what happens when you do that. You'll have to let me know. And Ryan says he's having some waffles right now. Bro, I can't even remember the last time I had waffles. I'd love some waffles with ice cream and chocolate syrup right now. Oh, dude, some waffles would be freaking ace, man. Donkey Kong's a hoarder, keeping all the bananas for himself. Well, mate, we've got, we've currently got the My Sharona crisis worldwide. You never know when he's going to be able to get a, a, a banana again, you know? If, if I was Donkey Kong, I'd be hoarding all the bananas too. Did you see D-Wayne attempt to bust a groove last week? Unfortunately, I didn't. The only reason I'm not in D-Wayne streams uh, more often before I come on is because I'm rude. No, that's not the reason. The way our work schedule currently is going, unfortunately, I'm sleeping when D Wayne's on, which is why I only get to catch the end of his streams now. Again, don't forget, he's in America and I'm in Australia, and we're kind of ships ships passing in the night uh, in the night at the moment, unfortunately. Otherwise, I'd, I'd be in every, everyone's streams a lot more often. We've got um. And so D Wayne says today's game list is like if 2020 was a game list. Just wait till you see my 10 p.m., bro. <laughs> Just wait till you see my 10 p.m. This this one's not all that bad to be honest. I've had some fun games on this one. I, I usually do it vice versa, but I was kind of like YOLO today. I think I'll probably have 15 people by the end of my stream. <laughs> We're gonna go back. Oh, crap. <clears throat> hey, go. Hey, hey, go, Wild Eli. Good to see you, man. Thank you for coming in. We'll, we'll have to try it next time. Uh, oh, thank you, Austin. We'll have to try it next time, Austin. There we go. So, this is uh, this request is for our very, very good friend, uh, Captain BS. Captain BS, we just want to thank you for absolutely uh, everything you do for the channel. Now, I don't really have any fascination of doing this game. Uh, in a long play anytime soon, but what we are going to do, Captain BS, is do Donkey Kong Tropical Freeze uh, in the near future. So, um, yeah, man, I hope you enjoy that. It should be good. Oh, God, he's going to play Beta or EO. <laughs> All right. Uh, let me just get out of Nya. So, what are we going to do now? Where are we going to go next? Oh, we're gonna go talk to Cranky, all right? Let's... No, is it over here? So that that's two levels we've done now, right? Stars are glorious. Yeah, man, stars are great. 
You know what I was thinking? I was thinking of getting a Chuck Norris shout out pretty soon for you guys, but it's really, really expensive. But I'd, I'd, I'd love, because Chuck Norris is getting, uh, uh, you know, I don't, I don't want to be morbid or anything, but God bless him, he's in great shape, but he's getting a bit long in the tooth now. I, I want to be able to get an awesome Chuck Norris shout out while I still can, you know what I mean? Because, you know, I'm a bit of a Chuck Norris fan, I must say. And I love, I've been watching some of the uh, the, the jokes that um, the, the, the shout outs that Chuck Norris has been doing on Cameo. And he actually, with his shout outs, he sometimes does a Chuck Norris joke. So he's like a really good sport. How you going, Nick? Nick says, Rick, you love Don Donkey Kong Country. Well, dude, I wish I could take the credit. Uh, but you gotta, you gotta thank Captain BS for this one today, sir. This is all his doing. He's like, Rick, I want you to play this sumbish. And then, then I accidentally confused Captain BS's request with someone else's. Like a sunbish, didn't I, Captain BS? <laughs> when, 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 when Chuck Norris shouts out, you can hear him from Mars. I've heard that. I, 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 oh my gosh, get that sunbish. Why, why is that not working? I'm trying to jump on him. I thought you could jump on the bees. Well, I thought. Oh, hang on, I must be pressing the wrong button to do the. Hang on, give me one second here. Aren't you supposed to be able to like kick, hit him in the butt? Also, hang on. I thought you could jump on the bees. Maybe you can't jump on the bees. Alright, that's fine. Yeah, I, th I guess you can't jump on the bees. That's cool. And then Marco says, you two-year-old just said you're a hot dog. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Please, please, don't, give, don't, please don't give me a lawsuit. <laughs> I hope you didn't... I, 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 I hope you two-year-old didn't just do the pelvic dance. That's kind of drawing the line, isn't it? Oh, goodness. Marco, thank you so much. Marco just dropped the big 100 stars. Mar Marco can't be angry at me, otherwise he wouldn't have sent stars. So that's a big relief. Well, what are we going to give to Marco today? We're going to give you uh, this one, my friend. Thank you. Chuck Norris doesn't grow old, he grows young. This game actually surprisingly looks like really, really, really good on the original Game Boy, actually, doesn't it? Like, it looks really, really solid. I'm, I'm actually amazed that they could pull something like this off on the Game Boy, to be honest. Did you remember when you used to get this on the Game Boy? You'd get it in those, like, ah, oh, You'd get it on those special, uh, yellow cartridges. This seems better in some of the sequels. Oh, we, we did, um, we did, like, Donkey Kong Country 2, I remember, for one of the streams. And it did feel a little bit fiddly in comparison. Jeez, are we all the way back over here? Dude, okay, I forgot to save ages ago. Oh, that's alright, we'll get out of here. Alright, so that's done. So, alright, a little jumpy sunbish over here. He's got that Benjamin button. Alright, back of him, yeah. Alright, out we go. <sighs> So Brandon says Chuck Norris caught Corona and now it's in... Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Chuck Norris caught Corona and now Corona... I love it, man. You got... You got... You, you know what? It's too early in the morning for you guys for such jokes and it's too late in the evening for me. Alright. How you going, Jackie? Good to see you. Now you guys are great value. I feel like you've created a, a monster, D Wayne. You, st you started getting all those dad jokes happening, and now everyone's getting into the in the act. You got the Donkey Kong game for the Wii U. They, yeah, that's Donkey to Kong um, Tropical Freeze. That is an incredible game, Wild Eli. They re-released it on the Switch, and and that's actually the one that we're going to be playing on the channel like pretty soon. So uh, yeah, okay, we're going to keep going down here. Yeah, it's a night. I like the water level in this. See, I'd rather play this than Eco the Dolphin. I'm just saying, D-Wayne. Oh, look, we've got, like, little Larry the Swordfish. I don't know why his name is Larry, but, you know, let's just go with it. Larry the Swordfish. All right, there we go. Little checkpoint of him, y'all. So, how you doing, Jackie? You all right? Ryan says he's still in bed with his cat. Well, that's the one. Larry the Swordfish. Look at him poking his little freaking sword sword. Did I just call it a sword sword? I think I did. Uh, the arrows are saying we got to go down this way. 
Uh, is this the right way? I don't know if I'm going the right way or not. I'm just following Larry the Swordfish here. I think we're going the right way. Come on, pokey, pokey, pokey. Pokey, pokey, pokey. There we go. Gabby, how you doing? Good to see you. Yeah, I like, um, I see I'm crappy at these kind of games. So, in, in the Switch version, you can use a character called Cool Kong, I think his name is. And uh, it makes the game a lot easier for newbies like me, which is the only reason I'd be willing to play it. Otherwise, this game is unforgivingly hard without save states. Oh, look, the pearls of wisdom coming at me. Fuck, stay away from that, Rick. What are you doing, dickhead? All right, there we go. We made it, guys. Cool. <laughs> I'm just naming all the animals in this. You like the names that I give them? And I've got the one on Wii too. I've forgotten what that's called, but I have a copy. What is it? I've got it over here on a physical disc. What's the one on Wii called again? Let me have a look quickly. Donkey Kong... Uh... I can't see it there. I thought I had the physical copy. Oh, I do, but it's okay. I'll have to look later. Ryan says, here's 100 stars from Crackers. Well, a big shout out to you, Crackers. It's time to fist bump. I hope Crackers likes to fist bump because one coin only likes to fist bump. Thank you, Ryan and Crackers. Appreciate you guys. Fuck, well, let's get back to the game, mate. We're going to keep going along here. How, what do you, how do you think we're going, Captain BS? Am I making you proud today? Am I, am I doing okay? Am I making the Sunbish Army proud? Oh, this is that tricky one. We have, we have to keep going between barrels, isn't it? Uh, well, what's the one on... I've got, I've put it this way. I've got the one on Nintendo Wii and on Nintendo Switch. I've got physical copies of both. Well, there you go, guys. I'll play the Switch version soon. I don't think I've got the balls to do the Wii version. Is it, Captain BS says the game is going great. Yeah, I might have to save from here to continue on this time, huh? This is such a nice looking Super Nintendo game, this one. Oh, there we are. Boom. I'm actually surprised I've never uh, learned to completely play one of these games yet, huh? You know, you would think that after being on one coin only, for like, uh, I don't know, three years, that we would have at least played one of these games all the way through. To be honest, I think I've just been too scared to. It's not that I haven't wanted to. The new Donkey Kong Country has some... Yeah, it's called it's called Tropical Freeze, uh, Matt. That's what it's called. The game's called Tropical Freeze. And it's frozen, but there's like some like other things mixed in with it as well. And yeah, Wii U and Switch is Tropical Freeze. The, the Wii U... The Switch version's a re-release. Oh, damn. Well, that sucks. You liked Mortal Kombat on the Super Nintendo? Let's, let's do Mortal Kombat 3. Let's talk to D-Wayne about Mortal Kombat 3, huh? Man, I... I, uh... Man, I used to always rent out Mortal Kombat 3 on the Sega Genesis, and that was just a heartbreaking game. Oh. All right, no worries. Well, let's let's reload here. Shit, okay. Well, I didn't realize there was no platformity, man. Come on! So, Nick says, am I streaming on YouTube as well? Yeah, dude, I'm on both. I'm, uh, yeah. I'm on both Facebook and YouTube, my friend. And, uh, you just chill banging. Get back down from ya. Oh, goodness. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Oh crap. That's a one. Gotta watch out for that B, mate. Patience, Rick. It's all about pa Oh, that sucks. Oh, dude, this really sucks. So let's try again. Oh, stressing out. Oh my god, this is just going to shit now. I was doing well, and then something happened. You know what happened, Rick? You ran out of talent. 
Alright, can't wait to see his D's list. Five hours worth. Yeah, D Wayne's got another big list. D Wayne's got 19 games. And then I've got about uh, 16 uh, once D Wayne's done after this one. I'm only doing 16. That'll give me time to have a break in between and then have time to also set up the morning stream for the following day. I'm, just, I'm expecting to still be... Oh, dude, this is really driving me crazy. I can't keep fucking doing this. I forgot to save, and now I'm paying the... One more time. Oh, my gosh. See, now now you're seeing right here firsthand. Oh, for fuck's sake. Now you're seeing... Fuckity fuck, fuck you fucking motherfucking game. All right, you're seeing here first... Ah, oh, my God. Now you're seeing why I don't ever play Donkey Kong motherfucking country ever fucking in my fucking life. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'll calm down now. I'm sorry if there's children watching. Oh my gosh. Alright, here we go. Yeah, you've created a monster here, Captain BS. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Alright, calm down, Rick. Calm down. Take a deep breath. Oh, we got this. <laughs> I'm sorry about all the language, guys. So, Austin's like, you mad, brah. I'm a little bit mad. I've got, I've got to take a chill, pee, chill pill here, boys and girls. Good <laughs> so, I'm past Rick of Snickers, I know. Oh, my gosh. So, Captain BS says, even this level gave me the fit. So, so it's not just me. Well, I, oh, oh, no, not again. Oh, dude. Oh, my gosh. All right, here we go. Oh, come on, you son of a biscuit. You little mother bitch. Yeah, damn murder hornets, mate. That's right. Oh, son of a bitch. Yeah, uh, only in Brazil. Like, it's this very, very special Brazilian version. You know, where, where Seeker's from. Dude, weak. Oh, my God. There's actually a shortcut to this stage, apparently, but it's like a really tricky platform. Oh my gosh, get out of here, Rick. I'm so done with you assholes. Oh my gosh, how many respawns are there? Is that it? That better freaking be it. Oh, don't you freaking even ass wipe. All right, let's get in. <gasps> oh my gosh. We got it, guys. We got it. You wouldn't suggest that. That's because Dustin knows my skill level, you see. D uh, Dustin knows my skill level. Oh, goodness. All right. Thank you again for all the likes and shares, guys. You're incredible, especially this early in the morning. All right, let's do let's do one more level, and then we're going to move on. But uh, Captain BS, thank you again for an awesome request. Oh, wait, it's boss time. Well, that, that'll be cool. This will be the first world, and we'll save from here for next time. He's just going faster, mate. It's a pretty easy boss, isn't it? That's it. He's a dead bish. <laughs> My hey, hey, here we go. We got Mod Michael who's heard everything. Mod Michael says, Don't worry, Rick. Cursing's uh, totally acceptable. Thank you for having me uh, my back, man. I appreciate that. Oh, okay, look, you know what? We'll try the minecart level at least once. Just very quickly for Captain BS. Is, is there a minecart level here? All right, very, very quickly, we'll do this one. And then, and then we'll move on to the next game. The next game's a Dragon Ball game. Uh, for Alex. So, big thank you, Alex. It's on the PlayStation. I don't know what it's like or anything. Alright, one, 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 one lucky last level. Let's go, Captain BS. This one's dedicated to you, sir. Yeah, we got Mod Michael, aka Wolf, uh, Wolfman Gaming, guys. Don't forget to check him out. He's also on the Global Stream Machine, too. Fucking beauty this guy is, because you know why? He's a freaking Australian, mate. Oi, oi, and all that. We're gonna... Oh, crap. Well, let's go. You're on your lonesome there, donkey schlong. Ah, oh, God. Fuck. Go back over here. Uh, hey, hey, Nick says, good morning, Ricky. How you doing? Well, how does it look like I'm doing? Donkey Kong's like a manic depressive. He just jumped off a cliff. Oh, my goodness. No, I'm okay. We're just, uh... Oh, we're gonna... Oh, Captain BS, you didn't need to do that, guys. I've got to pause the stream for a second. Captain BS has dropped a big $15 super chat. And Captain BS says, Thank you for playing this request, man. I appreciate what you do. Are you not entertained? Man, I would love to. Here we go. This is for you, sir. Thank you very, very, very much. Are you not 
I'm going to give you two, sir, if you don't mind. And also this one. It is. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Dude, thank you so much. I really, really appreciate that. Captain BS with a big $15 super chat. I just hope I didn't butcher your game too much. So Lee says you can move faster. Lee, I'm too uncoordinated. Does it look like I need to move any bloody faster? Lee's all like, Rick, you know what? You can move faster. But you know what's going to happen if I move faster? I'm going to, like, get a splinter on my foot and I'm going to die. Thomas, how you going? Thomas with a big hundred stars. Thank you, Thomas. Thomas says, here's a few stars to cheer. Hey, I'm not upset. I'm not upset, Thomas. Some of these games are pussing me off a little bit. But I'm okay, Thomas. This is for you. Oh, my goodness. Oh, no worries, Antonio. Enjoy your shift. We'll see you again this evening, hey? I'm glad we got you at a good time. Take care, bud. All right, so Adam has requested Dragon Ball uh, GT for the PS1. So we're going to do this now. Uh, Mikey, as I always say, you've got some great taste in games. You've got some great taste. Especially on the Nintendo Wii. A lot of cool, cool stuff on Nintendo Wii. Oh, this, I, bet, I better skip this because, you know, Facebook and cutscenes, I'll probably lose the page. Oh, that was a minecart. Ah, uh, damn. Sorry, guys. I didn't realize. I, I didn't mean. I didn't mean to stooge Captain BS on his time. We did, we did a fair few. Okay, battle. Dragon Ball GT. Okay, versus Kong. Okay, I guess we're gonna be uh, this, this uh, guy. Goku versus Goku. Now, don't strong. forget, if I miss any comments, guys, fight. make sure you let me know. I don't mean to be rude on purpose. Um, Thomas, you are a great human being. I, I, just, just like everyone else, I want you to know that. All right. Well, I mean... So, this, this the controls here are a little bit stiff. But, dude, it's not without its charm. Okay, so a little, little bit choppy here, but that's okay. I mean, I do, for a PS1 game, this actually looks pretty neat, to be honest. It's just, I wasn't expecting it to be a 3D game. I was expecting it to be one of the cartoon ones. Yeah, man, it's a, it's a, it's a little bit hard to, like, it's... I don't know what's going on here. I'm getting my ass absolutely freaking handed, handed to me, though. Yeah, yeah, can I have a turn two, please? Stop kicking my ass, mate. What the hell? What the hell's going on, bruh? What the f I don't even know what's going on anymore. Goku just got his freaking whole life handed to him on a freaking sunbish. Oh, okay, yeah, no worries, bruh. Dude, are you kidding me? Okay, can I have a turn now or nah? Okay, no worries. What? That didn't really work out, did it? Oh, there we, we ended up winning somehow. Okay, that's interesting. How you going, Gene? Good to see you. That was a bit too close. Yeah, look, as I, as I said, like, the game looks really nice. It sounds great. The, the controls are a bit stiff. They don't really so flow too well. You are. Ha, Lawrence says this game is whack. I don't think it's one of those games that's whack on purpose. I feel like this is one of those games that was like probably really fun back in the 90s, but we've kind of evolved from these kind of controls. You know, I feel like there's such a delay on the attacks. Like, when you press an attack button, you don't uh, get a move in. Like, yeah, it's... That's alright, we'll, 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 we'll do it, we'll do what we can. There's not like a massive delay, like I hit the kick button and there's like a, a minute, there's like a second delay. It's, it's not a, it's, yeah, see look at that, it's not a risk. It's weird. So how do you pick for whatever Wednesday? Yeah, so what you do is you pick any game, PS2 or older, and uh, you send it to our page by clicking on message, my friend. And don't forget, if you do want to get a subscription, you can also make a Whatever Wednesday request. 
Um, anything that I get now will go on next week's list because our only rule is like 24 hours in advance. And no talky talky games. So, no, no, no RPGs that have nothing but text boxes for 20 minutes because that kind of sucks. Oh yeah. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to be able to give this a, the full time Alex. I'm trying here, but this is this game is really not that playable, good sir. Just, just to be straight up and honest with you, bud. But uh, we'll, we'll fight through this for a little while. I think everyone still appreciates the fact that there's something Dragon Ball on board, so not all is lost. Oh my gosh. Alright, so... Can... Uh, get, get back out of the sky, mate. Yeah, I just... I, I can't play this, man. This is... <laughs> oh, man, I just... I can't even begin to explain how bad the controls are, dude. Oh, my gosh. I mean, I don't... I, I, anyone else ever played this before? Maybe you can give me some advice. Oh my gosh, this is... <laughs> Alright, you know what I'm going to do, Alex? I'm going to do one I'm gonna do one more match after this, and then we're going to have to move on, bud. This is, um... Ooh, really tedious. It's all good. Let's, let's try one more time for our friend. One more time. Oh, boy. The next game we got after this is Zero Wing for Colin, by the way. I think that's a shooter on the Sega Jet. Oh, I was going to pick a different... That doesn't matter. Let's keep trying to use Goku. I think if I pick a different character, I'll probably go even worse. Yeah, no worries, Ryan. Thank you, man. Alright, there we are. I'm just, I'm just curious if Alex, if Alex, if you go back and watch this, like, you'll have to tell me what I'm doing wrong, because I have a funny feeling this was a childhood game of yours and you actually knew what you were doing. My god. Oh, there we go, we got that little Nink and Poo. No, I don't, I don't hate talky talky games on a mainstream, like if you're playing an RPG, Mike, and you've got three hours, then you can set up a narrative and play the game, but for whatever Wednesday request where you only get like 15, 20 minutes, you're not even playing any game, you know? It's different, but yeah, exactly. So it's just the format of this particular show. I've got nothing against RPGs. A lot of people think I don't like RPGs. That's 100% false. A lot of, you know, people don't separate whatever Wednesday. Yeah, I have to stop playing this. I'm sorry, guys. This is, um... This is a really, really crummy game. It's a really crummy game. <laughs> Yeah, I know that's what you were saying. Sorry, see, I was reading your comment a little bit fast and I finally got it halfway through. That's that's my bad, Michael. Don't worry about me. I'm just talking a whole pile of crap today. All right, I feel really, really bad for that. I'm so sorry, Alex, but I just could not play your game today. But that was uh, Dragon Ball GT. If you Next time I'll make up with a little bit more time, sir. But uh, yeah, that, that game's not really playable, man. May, maybe try again next week. So, uh... The next game we got is Zero Wing, and uh, this one's gone out to our good friend Colin. Chris dropping a big 100 stars. Chris, thank you so much. This is going out to you. Well, thank you, Randy. We did pretty good. We got about three chapters done with Chris today. And speaking of Chris, Chris with a big 100 stars. Thank you again, sir. You are an absolute legend. And for some reason, uh, this emulator is not capture. Ah, I see why not. Now let's see if this works. Okay, I need to reload again. My bad. And, uh, oh god, man, this is being a little bit tedious here! I'm gonna have to pop me someone. Zero wing. Alright, we got this. This should work now. 
Mel says she's... Oh, Topland. So this is the same company that made Snow Brothers. There we go. We're going to give ourselves some more lives so we can rapid fire on. Yes, please. So let's see how we go. I've never done a shooter from Topland before. Good, cool company, though. The favorite rant. RPG rant. Yeah, I'll do my RPG rant again at the 10 p.m. show. Aussie rant. Don't tell me how to play the game rant. Four. Yes, I know the screen is black rant. That, yeah, and you know, most, that most of them are my fault. If not all of them. Hey, how, how you going, Christine? Good to see you. Come on, star. Good to see you. Your Chromecast has been dicky. Finally got you on the big screen now. Well, there you go. You're blowing up this big, sexy face. Only a mother could love, hey? Let's see how we go with this bad boy. All right, so here we go. This is Zero Wing. It's about a spaceship that has zero wings, I guess. So I'm just trying to work out what the buttons all do. Oh, so what happens? Oh, so you can shoot the enemies back at each other? That's kind of cool, actually. All right. Once again, this one's going out to Colin. Thank you for your request today. Streamer life. Oh, yeah, man. I love it. We all bond over the same shit. Like, you know, we I just love it. I love relating with other streamers. No, honestly, it doesn't matter if you're a small streamer, a medium streamer, or a large streamer. Everything we go through is all exactly the same. And it's just... It's almost like there's this code. <laughs> the co uh, just this code where we can relate with, e with each other with everything. Oh, Gerardo's also got me on the Chromecast. I love the music in this. I tell you what, like... I, I felt like the, the Sega Genesis for me was like, or Mega Drive as we called it, was a real double-edged sword. Because you had those soundtracks that were just re those really dirty guitar string, string sounding soundtracks. Which just really drove me nuts. And then you've got really nice soundtracks like this one, which just... You just get some absolute beauty sometime as well. And, uh... So Mel says nobody relates. Oh, come on now, Mel. Don't be like that, Mel. I don't... I, I, you know what I think your problem is, Mel? You don't give yourself enough credit. I think, I think you're much more awesome than you realize. Truly. So you're off to, to shit roundhouse? Oh, it's a star roundhouse. To shit roundhouse? What are you talking about, James? Yeah, we'll see you tonight. Take care, brother. I don't, I don't know what it is you're exactly doing. I hope it doesn't involve taking a shit, because that's how I read it. But, uh, no, James, thank you for everything, bud. We'll see you later today. Ah, oh, damn, I just got smoked. Oh, it smoked like a freaking Christmas ham. Oh, there you go. I've got my regular attack powers on again. All right. How you going there, Jay? Good to see you. Oh, don't worry. Don't worry about me, Jay. I just blew up into a thousand pieces. That's what Rick does, mate. And, uh, all right. We're going to save here. Come on, stay. Fuck. Don't you shoot me, mate. Don't you shoot me. So, I'm guessing Stephen Fields actually grew up with this game. Because Steve says he was really excited for this one. I had never heard of it uh, until I put it on today, to be honest, bud. Oh, we got this one. Oh, shit. Wrong button. Oops. There we go. Ah, dude, you mother bitch. Sorry. So how are we supposed to shoot that sucker? All right, so what's this? Is this the laser beams again? All right, I feel like the laser beams are more powerful, so... Might want to hold on to those, sucker. All right. What's this one? Oh, no, you know what? Missiles are pretty strong too, aren't they? There we go. And they kind of dip. There you go. We're going to drop bombs. Fuck! Don't you even, Rick! Damn, I'm so bad at shooters. It doesn't matter what shooter you pick, guys. All shooters are a D-Wayne game. Like, I'm, I'm totally serial. Oh, my gosh! Ugh. Fuckity. Alright, excuse me. Alright, oh, my gosh. I, ah, damn it. Mother bitch, yeah, wrong button. Hashtag wrong button. <laughs> it's always the wrong button. The wrong button's always the... Ah, oh, good. Fuck him. Alright. Yeah, it's a nice, it's a nice R-Type sort of like clone, isn't it? It reminds me more of R-Type than anything. I tell you what, as much as I'm struggling, this game is not as hard as R-Type. That I can tell you. I would have blown up 50 times by now if this was R-Type, guys. 
So what's this um, bitch around the corner? How do we get in there? Just over the top? Mother beer. <laughs> Aaron says, I oh, will thank you, Aaron. Flattery will get you everywhere, sir. Oh my goodness. Oh, dude. Bad, don't you even, Rick. Don't you even. Don't you start blowing up, Rick, or there's going to be problems. You know what? It'd be nice if we at least got up to a second bar. Ah! <laughs> oh! Oh my gosh. All right, we got that sunbish. Is that the end of the level? Was that the boss? Yeah, our, our type is tough, man. I've not played the turbo graphics, or have I? No, I did actually once. I, think I did that recently. Oh, dude, I don't like this one as much. So Jado says you don't start at nine. Any? I started at nine, Jado. I, I've been I've been on for uh, an hour already. I did start at nine, Jado. Nine a.m. Eastern, my friend. And uh, yeah, don't forget I'm at nine a.m. Eastern. So Commodore does nine a.m. Eastern uh, Monday. I do nine a.m. Eastern Tuesday to Thursday. And sometimes I come on Friday, but most times I can't. So I might have to change the roster a little bit. I've got too much really important stuff to do uh, for my other hustle on Friday. So uh, sometimes morning streams in the in the in on Fridays most of the time are not possible. But I do Tuesday to Thursday at 9 a.m. and Commodore does Monday. And I'll try and increase that in the future. So Mike says, what about Fantasy Zone? I love Fantasy Zone. I'm actually aiming to get a physical copy of that for my Master System collection. One and two. They're both really good. But yeah, no, I've got UN Squadron, sure. No, UN Squadron's fantastic. If you had if you asked me what my favorite shooter is, my favorite shooter is actually G Darius. Um, and I'm not good at G Darius, I just love the graphic style. I think it's phenomenal. So, I really, really love G-Darius myself. Oh my gosh, this is hard. Damn it, let's try again. And so, Jen says, did you get rid of my green screen? No, I still have my green screen. I'm just mixing things up a bit to keep it fresh. So, you know, once this starts to feel a bit stale, I'll pull out the green screen again. You know, I just, uh... I don't want to get complacent, you know, guys. I'm just trying to give you different things to see and... I mean, let me know if you like it. Have you been enjoying me not using the green screen? Or are you like, uh, bring it back? Just thought you guys might like to see my sexy bed and bedroom. Oh man, I'd love the original Space Harrier cabinet. I'm going to go on the lookout for one, Randy. I don't know if they're selling them in Aussie. You know what, I might see if, if they're cheap enough. I might get one freighted YOLO. Yeah, G Darius is nuts. Hey man, I love the music. Dude, it's pretty cool. We can, I can actually almost give this game its full time. Um, because I really, really sucked at the last one. Again, Adam, I do apologize that I was so garbage at um, Dragon Ball, dude. I will try and make it up in your next request. I, I just couldn't play it properly, bud. I don't know what else to say. <laughs> well, hey, this is cool. You, you think it looks more professional? Okay. As I said, it's going to look even better next month when I get the new HD webcam. Because uh, right now it's a little bit grainy and a bit washed out. But once I get, get some more lights and the new 1080 camera, uh, it's going to look mint. Like, it'll look really good, I promise you. So just give me another few weeks and it's going to be better again. Well, thank you, nobody cares ever. Don't you forget about my boy Como, hey? The one, the one point only is in the three amigos, mate. My little buttercup. Remember that movie? Yeah, Three Amigos, mate. Alright, there we are. How you going, John? Good to see you. So, apparently it's four and a half grand for a space area cabinet. You'll buy two, one for you and the other to ship directly to Australia to a friend. Man, I can't ask you to spend four and a half grand for Sylvain. What the hell? I would never ever get you. No. Bro, I, I, I could not take a gift ever that big. Unless your name is Bill Gates. If you were Bill Gates and you were throwing around those billions, then I might be like, all right, you know what? You can buy me a Space Harrier cabinet. That's okay, Bill. But, uh, no, not you, sir. <laughs> you think this reminds you of Contra? I mean, I mean, shooter's a shooter, right? 
I'm genuinely enjoying this. Like, this is a challenge without being too ball-breakingly hard. And I could kind of still socialize uh, with you guys while I play this too. So get some points for that also. But no, I, would I ever play this game again? Uh, not only would I play this game again, but I would recommend this to D-Wayne. I know D-Wayne, like, he's a little bit picky when it comes to shooters, but I know D-Wayne likes shooters more than what I do. And uh, I don't know if you're still in the room, D-Wayne, but I think you might actually really like this one, but I would give it a try. It's called uh, Zero Wing, and uh, it's definitely the best shooter I've played on the channel for a while. Well, thank you, Sylvain. I appreciate the thought. <laughs> Yeah, this is just really fun. I don't usually get into shooters this much. So this, don't forget, this was request uh, is for our friend Colin, and, and Colin's always requesting shooters. One of his favourites is that uh, very naughty and cheeky, sexy Parodius, which you've seen a couple times. And uh, all right, yeah. Oh right, well, you know what we'll do? I guess we'll get to the end of this level if we can, and uh, we'll beat the boss hopefully. And. Uh, We'll move on to the next game after that. What did I say is next? Oh, we got Star Wars Bounty Hunter for Adam next. Okay, that's going to be interesting. No dramas, mate. Melissa says looking up Zero Wing. Yeah. I wonder how popular this was when it actually came out. Just like this area. Everything, man. The gameplay, the music. You couldn't give you a precise definition, but many... Oh. <laughs> All the Aussies in the room starting to get a bit tricky. Look out. This bit's not that hard, actually. This, this level actually feels easier in the... Either this level's easier in the last one, or we're just warmed up now. Okay, it's a little challenging. Oh, we're gonna... Oh, no, don't you even, Rick. Unrick dog, get out of here. Alright, we made it, that's fine. I had a feeling that was going to be a bit fishy. Hey, no, I haven't actually, John. I mean, I've heard about it, but I've not I've not particularly tried that one myself. Hey, we got Southern Bell Gaming, good to see you. It's so crazy, you see you before bed and right when you wake up. Oh, gosh, you know what? It's nice to know that I'm the first thing on your brain before you go to bed and when you wake up, Brittany. Thank you for coming in, sweetheart. Guys, don't forget to please check out, as you can see, my good friend here, Southern Bell Gaming. Yeah, it's Wednesday. You've lost track of time, huh? Poor Brittany's lost track of time. She must be run off her feet with Navi at the moment. And so, uh, Mike says it'd be uh, um, awesome if every gamer could afford a, an arcade cabinet. If I could have two arcade cabinets, the two I would pick is Space Harrier, and then the very brand new uh, Maximum Tune 6. I don't know if you guys have played Maximum Tune 6, but it's basically a nightclub in a video game. Like, it's freaking awesome. And, uh... Oh, so this is level 3. Alright, well, let's just do this for a little minute. Jeffrey says it's his birthday tomorrow. Happy birthday, Jeffrey. How old are you turning, if you don't mind me asking? And then you say Ricky's all... Oh. <laughs> oh, you. Oh, you. Uh. Hmm. Hey, so Southern Bell Gaming's putting up a red flag. Oh, gosh. So, so, Southern Bell Gaming, what do we got to go on Mori Povich for this time? What's happened? What's hap- what's hap- what's happened? Yeah, who are we giving a lie detector test to, Southern Bell? Who are we giving a lie detector test to? Who- who are we gonna give a lie detector test to? <laughs> and, uh, so Charles says we need to play your phone shooter, Freedom Hawk Squadron. Freedom Hawk Squadron? I don't think I know that one, actually. Yeah, but you see, I don't want a Space Harrier cabinet. Like, you can get the stand-up Space Harrier cabinets, I think, Jerry. But I don't want that one. The only Space Harrier cabinet I'm interested in owning is the very awesome hydraulic cabinet that, you know, that moves side to side. Uh, we're going to do this here. Oh, goodness. 
Yeah, very happy birthday. I hope you have a lovely day planned, my friend. We appreciate you here very much at one point, Jeffrey. Right, so let's see what's over here. It's so that is what she said, bro. It's very much what she said. Alright, so we are going to have to move on in a little second, but we've given this the full time. The only thing... Man, you know, I feel like... I don't know what it's like to, to watch this. I know a lot of shooters can start feeling repetitive, but I think because of the awesome different types of firepower you get in this game, it's kind of always feeling interesting to me. You can... Yeah, pretty much, Mikey. That's what I'm hoping. Maury called Rick. He said you're not the... Oh. Well, that's a bummer. Hey, Manuel, thank you so much. Manuel just dropped a big 200 stars. And, uh, Manuel, this is going out to you, my friend. It's kind of like every relationship I've had. Dude, thank you very, very much, Manuel. And how are you doing today? You all good? I don't know how far away we are from the end, but we're going to go, uh... Then just go another little, a few little minutes. And uh, don't forget to keep smashing those thumbs ups, guys. We are almost on 100 likes already, which is absolutely incredible. So thank you for that. So D Wayne says you just ordered Shaving Simulator 2020. Gonna request it for you, dude. Is that, are you kidding me? Or are you like, oh, are you gonna request it for yourself? Oh, hang on, I'm okay. I'm dead. All right, we're gonna have to leave this one now. Yeah, that just threw me. Is that actually a thing? Or are you just cracking a joke that you want to shave? I'm totally confused. That's just gone over my head. Maybe I'm just a sumbish. I'm not sure. All right, so that one was for Colin. Colin, that was really, really fun. Thank you so much for your request. Um, as I said, the next game's to Adam. And Adam, we got Star Wars Bounty Hunter here. And uh, I don't know, I've got high hopes for this. I, I think this could be fun. Let's have a look, huh? And so, um... Manuel says, by the way, Wendy was your, uh... Oh, you meant, you mean Weenie? Weenie Cooper, hey? I used to like Weenie Cooper. Because when I, you know, I, she was a little bit older than me when it was on. So, you know, she was like that older crush. Yes, but when I was little, I liked Weenie. Alright, Star Wars Bounty Hunter. Let's, let's see what we got. Alright, memory card slot A. So I'm playing uh, now. I know you asked for this uh, on the uh, PS2. Uh, I'm playing it on the GameCube instead, Adam. Just usually because emulation works on the GameCube a lot better. I, I didn't think you'd mind because it's practically the same thing. All right, play game. So let's just go. <laughs> Wouldn't surprise me. That's that's what I mean. There's like a simulate. That's. That's why I didn't know if it was a joke or not, Ryan, because there's a simulator for everything now. Yeah, oh my gosh, there's a sh- What the fuck is wrong with people? There's a simulator on Steam called Showering With My Dad. The a button to fire, hold the button to lock on. All right, well, where's my A button? Okay, I'm trying to do this. I don't have any guns right now, I don't think, so I'm just going to keep punching him in the head. Alright, so so what are we going to do? I just said A button to fire. Do, do I have any weapons here? Oh, there we go, I do have some weapons. Damn, this is games controlling... Start screwing up with the D-pad again for some reason. Oh, there we go, that's better. Alright, so now, now we got this. Alright, so we're gonna start shooting him. Oh, get out of there, Rick. What are you doing? Get up, some bish. Uh, it's, it's got like those inverted uh, controls as well for the camera that you love, D Wayne. This has totally got those inverted controls for the camera that you love, which is like topsy turvy. Why well, am I supposed to kill him? How do I mark it, really? I've never played this before, guys, so I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I don't even know if I'm doing the right thing or not. I'm just trying to shoot a sunbish. Why well, how do I don't know how do I know if it's even working or not? Is, is, is it even hurting him? Dude, what the hell? Oh, there's a little rolly poly move. So we can lock oh there you go, so that's how you target him and you see he's got a, a okay there you go. 
Well, that's easy enough. At least I sort of worked something out here. So you're saying the D isn't working? No, the D is not working properly. I should probably get some Kamagra or something. Okay, I said too much. Just keep blasting his ass. All right, Ryan, we got him. He's sorted. So what, we're going to go the next level now, or what's happening? Are we going to get another buddy to play with? Well, he's dead, so what now? Do I just gut him like a fish, or where do I go? Well, I don't know. I just killed him. What the fuck am I supposed to do now? Just go in here, maybe? All right, cool. You press Y to use a cutting torch. All right, I'm going to open the doors, mate. Well, let's, let's go, Boba Fett. Let's kick some ass, mate. Here we go, Boba. Here we go. Uh, uh. Alright, well, there we go. We've got some health. It's all good. Back to full health. Alright, activate the panels. Alright, so I mean, this game looks really, really nice, actually, for a, an old game. I, I, I definitely think this looks better on GameCube than it probably would in PlayStation. What we got down here? Alright, look at that. Oh, cool. Going down. Corner. Oh, no, no, you're right, Ryan. Shoes exposed body. There you go. D Wayne getting a bit kinky in these early morning streams, huh? They think D think D Wayne needs his early morning cold shower. I'm just saying. All right. So now where have I got to go? Where do you go, my son, bish? Press the X button to crouch. All right. I'm gonna pre press the old crouch button. Let's get back. Where's the X button, mate? All right. In here we go. So D Wayne says this gets highly cryptic in about 10 seconds. I was kind of expecting that. I kind of totally expected that. See, because I'm, a, you know, why I expected that, D Wayne? Because I'm a cynical asshole. All right, we're gonna. Um, all right, up, up here we go. So that's Boba's son, Django. Oh, there you go. And uh, all right, press B button to jump. And grab an edge. All right. Well, I mean, he doesn't really have the Jordan. Hang oh, look at that. All right. Well, let's go. Oh, look at you go, Boba Fett. Look, you got like this is like Boba Fett, the Tomb Raider, and fucking you, asshole. All right. Well, now what am I supposed to do? Well, get back up there, you son bitch. Fucking. Excuse my language, guys. Just getting a bit. A little bit frustrated. Hey, how you going, Kid Jackson? Good morning. It was a good morning until I had to start playing frickin' Tomb Raider over here. He thinks he's a Lara Croft looking sumbish. Last last time I looked, you weren't Lara Croft, mate. What are you doing? Look, I tell you what, for starters, you don't have the biddies. Alright, we mate. Alright, now what are we gonna do? Uh, are we even going the right way? Let's go in here. Some of Nico's fucks have decent prices on their heads, too. I'll transmit the info to Boba's the dad, Jango. Yeah, Jango. Yeah. There you go. Take that. All right, now now we can do some shooty shooty stuff. Thankfully, that you know the good. Can I change these controls? This is really pissing me off. There's there's no way I can change the inverted controls. I don't think that is really frustrating. I would have had to have done it on the main menu. I think, but that's fine. Oh my gosh! And now the camera is just having a life of. Oh, the camera is moving on its. A oh, dude. Dude, the camera's just taking on a life of its own right now. Alright, let's go. Alright. Man, this... <laughs> oh, gosh. Can we shoot the droid? Alright, now where are we gonna go? Oh, hello, mate. How you doing? Okay, we're sort of getting this rounded here, but that's cool. Hey, good morning, Alex. Good to see you. Thank you for coming in. d -Wayne says, now just use the force and believe in yourself. Do you think the Do you think the Force believes in me? Uh, I don't. I don't think the Force gives a, a flying fuck about one coin. Uh, can we not pick up those swords? Well, that's very nice. Thank you very much. So Randy says, "What's your language, Rick? Your ears are bleeding." I'm sorry. I know. I'm getting worse and worse by the day. Oh, I'm not sure where to go now. I can hear a screaming crowd somewhere. So, I don't know, do we go in this? Do we have to touch that? No? Maybe in here. Alright, back up here. So, Lynn, this is Star Wars Bounty Hunter. We're going to play this Boba Fett sumbish today. Um, Joseph, if you're still in here, uh, I'm either going to sneak your game up the list next, 
or I'm gonna save it till last because I want to do the arcade shooters together because it'll just make it easier. So actually, no, I'm I'm just gonna sneak Joseph's request up the list next. Uh, the next game is Earthworm Jim on Sega Master System, and then I'll finish with the arcade shooters. It just seems like the most reasonable uh, way to go, as long as you don't mind, Joseph, putting you on a little bit earlier. So what am I supposed to do here? How you doing, Cruz? I am doing very well, thanks, mate. I don't know where the fuck to go, but maybe I'm supposed to turn on this computer or something. Maybe blow it up. Patrick says it's bedtime. You no, know, that's okay, dude. I understand. I don't know how to open this. I feel like I'm supposed to, like... Oh, hey, I'm dead. What up? So, well, what am I supposed to do? Blow up this computer? I, I don't know. I don't know. This is starting to get a bit cryptic. Shoot that bin to disable it. You have to shoot the bin to disable the shield? Well, how are you supposed to... Oh, my gosh. How are you supposed to know that? Oh, my goodness. Steve says you've never seen this. Well, I don't know if you're missing out on anything, bro. It's okay. We're gonna, we're gonna have to feed these little sunbishes to the pit monster, I think. How you going, Colin? We just finished uh, playing your game, sir, but I really, really enjoyed it. Thank you for your request this week. You go back and have a watch, mate. Yeah, but we just we just finished your game. I I think that's the best. I think Zero Wing is honestly the best shooter you've picked so far. I really enjoyed it. I wanted to keep playing, to be honest. And, uh, morning, Alexander. We've got Alexander in here, too. Good to see you. Gonna, uh, alright, let's, uh... Oh, so that's all sore. Alright, we're gonna go in here. I'm, I'm just happy that I lasted more than five minutes in this. I was worried to get... Oh, my God. No, don't, 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 don't count it too soon, Rick. This, this is not one of the, the AAA Star Wars titles, so this is actually, as I said, pleasantly, surprisingly good. We're going to look for another elevator now. So D-Wayne says he beat this while making... Oh, there you go. Look at D-Wayne. He's flexing. He's swinging it, guys. D-Wayne swinging it. I'd expect that from many people on this channel, D-Wayne, but I would not expect that from you. And I'm not angry, bro. I'm just disappointed. He's flexing. You're hot dogging. It was, uh, you, we, we call it hot dogging, don't we? I know, I know a few things about hot dogs, if you couldn't tell. Damn. All right. <laughs> oh, hundred percent. With without a freaking doubt, there, there's no doubt about it, Jerry. Oh, dude, I have to go all the way back. No, what the hell, Rick? Where you going, mate? Where are you going? I, there's no mini map or nothing, so I don't even. All right, I have to reload. I'm stuck. All right, let's just. All right, let's just go back over here. It's like, uh, <laughs> and then, yeah, see, Cap, you see, Cap wants to see you flex it, D-Wayne. I want to see you flex it too, bud. You're not getting off the hook. Oh my gosh. Are those good? <laughs> they, they totally look like Goombas, don't they? They really do. Uh, Ian on YouTube, D-Wayne, just told you to put away your eggplant. Hey, you, you gotta save the eggplant for Veronica. Veronica loves eggplant. Is this health? Oh, thank God, we got a full health back. All right, now, now, Lee, the good news is we got full health. The bad news, I've got no idea where we're supposed to go now. Um, so that's the way we came in. I'm pretty sure that's the way we came in. So the, the, these might just be some bonus. Oh, what's up here? Can we open this? So no, we can't go there yet. All right, that's fine. Oh, I guess we have to go back for a minute, which is fine. Oh, this is Star Wars Bounty Hunter, Alexander. It's a, it's about uh, uh, Django here, apparently. Okay, no, that's the way we came in. So, all right, so this that's the way we came in. There's got to be another door over here. Um... There's no, there's literally no other door. I don't know where to go. This is officially where I'm stuck. Unless there's like a key or something in one of these lockers that we're supposed to find. I guess we can have another quick look. 
Now I'm stuck. I don't know where to go. Go where Destiny where's Jamie Foles about to crack I was about to crack the Jamie Fox joke, but I was just like, nah. That would have been too easy. <laughs> that would have been too easy. Yeah, it would have been much too easy. Maybe I'm supposed to cl Oh! Oh, well this is some Tomb Raider bullshit right here. Fuck, lucky I checked, huh? Some Tomb Raider garbage. Alright, let's, let's, let's go, freaking... Oh, you mother bitch. Lucky I saved, huh? Oh my gosh, this is... Can you imagine doing this without save states? I'd be like, nah, -uh, I'm not having it today, player. I'm not having it. Oh, there we go. Come on. Jeez, this is really... Alright, let's go, brother. Oh my gosh. D-Wayne missed Ricky. No, D-Wayne was here. D-Wayne's been here the whole time, pretty much, man. He's just chilling in the background. This is, this is one of those up and yeah, it's one of those up and one of those up and down levels. It, it certainly is. But I've 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 somewhat been enjoying this. It, it must be said. I don't know how we're gonna go in uh, freaking uh, Earthworm Jim, but we'll amuse ourselves in a sec. All right, let's go in here. Oh gosh. This, this game is certainly not without its charm. I'm going to be straight up and, and admit this is a lot better than I thought it would be. Uh, so again, thank you very much for your request, Adam. And, uh... Alright, we're going to... Wow, Flo Florida's that hot today, huh? What kind of temperatures are you getting lately, D-Wayne? Oh my gosh, this is, this is a bit rough. We can do it. Dude, this is, I can't control the camera properly. <laughs> Alright, we got it. We can open that door. Oh my gosh. Alright, let's go in here. I mean, we're, we're making some kind of progress today. Alright, uh, more health. Fantastic. At least the health is pretty forgiving. Alright, let's go in here. You didn't know, you know, would I ever do a long play of this? No, and the only reason why is because I know in another five minutes I'll get lost forever and not know where to go. That's, that's my only issue. So are we just supposed Oh gosh. Come on, you son. Where are you going, mate? There you go. We're going to get rid of those horrible, horrible sand people that just want to murder me. Oh, goodness. Alright, what's, what's... Oh, is that, is that a sunbish over here? Yeah, he's just hiding, trying to ambush me. It's not going to work today, brother. You cooked eggs on the side... Wow, okay, yeah, that is... <laughs> okay, point, point, point noted. Alright, uh, 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 so we're going to hit this button here. Can we, do we, do we have to press the button? I don't even know. Alright, let's just see if we can jump up here. Fuck, what are you doing, Rick? Oh my gosh, the camera's just moving on its own. It's really frustrating. Alright, here we go. So, so how do we open this? Alright, I think this is about where I'm stuck, guys. Yeah, I think this is just about where I'm stuck, everybody. Well, unless I can shoot it from the other side, I'll have one more look. One, one more look over here. So let's have a look on this top floor. Oh, so I can, I can, so I can go like this, and I've got to sh Oh, there you go. So let's see if we can go up over there and, and jump across or something. People are baking cookies inside their parked cars. Oh, only, only in Florida, hey? Oh, there we go. So we're going to... This is not... This has certainly got that Tomb Raider vibe, doesn't it? I wasn't expecting that kind of game, to be honest. This has definitely got the Tomb Raider vibes. Alright, now I don't know where to go. I just... Well, where am I supposed to go now, you sumbish? Maybe I've got to shoot these barrels, you think? Hmm. Oh, no, I can go up in here. Wow, okay. Dude, could you imagine if you didn't look, you would... Oh. <laughs> That's what happens when you pay a kid to... Oh, yeah, it is. This is nuts. 
Yeah, you, you tell them me, Mike. As I said, if they remade this with modern controls, would I jump at it? I'd probably give it a crack. It's not without its charm. You get out through the beast handler's headquarters. Brian Good. Okay, there's like a boss in there, apparently. I can't believe we actually made it to a boss. Uh, I don't know how to get it. Fuck it, Eve. You can hear, you can hear the, the roars of the crowd here. They just want to thirst for blood. Oh, I'm trying to get to you, mate. I don't know how to get in there. Try, trying to find a way in. Well, I don't know. Can you see anything? Can't open the gate, mate. Mate, maybe I'll just go to... Hmm, I can I... Yeah, this is probably where I'm stuck. Alright, no, I don't know, guy. Oh, hang on, what's this guy gonna do? Is he gonna let me in? Alright, well, there we go. What you doing? What's, where, are you, where are you going? Oh, we're gonna go up. Alright, let's just follow some bitch over here. Alright, well, what am I supposed to do? Why shouldn't I shoot you? Open the gate then, dickhead. Oh, I don't know, did we get a key or something? I guess we're gonna find out. Oh, I don't know. Alright, alright, this is this is probably where we're stuck, guys, to be honest. Yeah, okay, this, this is this is where I lose patience with the game now. But you know what? That was actually a better run than I thought it was gonna be. Alright. We're going to leave that one there. That one was going out to Adam. That was Star Wars Bounty Hunter. It can Star Wars Bounty fuck off. No, actually, that's I'm only half serious. That game was actually not so bad. That was actually one of the games that was better than I was expecting. So thank you for your request, Adam. I really appreciate you. We're going to bump Joseph one up the list. And we're going to do Earthworm Jim uh, on the... On the... Fuckity, fuckity, fuckity. Uh, excuse me, guys. I just need to reset my controls. And, uh... Alright, so let me just, uh... Earthworm Jim on the Master System. This is a Brazil release. And, uh... I've got to find where I put it now. Alright, Earth. Yeah, man. So many things to find. Alright. Yeah, you got to shoot that guy. I couldn't get in the gate, mate. I didn't know what was going on. She's a big girl. Yeah, man. She was a bit of a big mama's house. <clears throat> she was a little bit of a big mama's house. We're getting there. Guys, we're speaking of getting there, guys, we're almost on our like goal of, well, we've got to get 150, guys. We're a little bit off. But you can do it. You can do it. We need an earthworm gym. No, that ain't ever going to happen. All right, so let's see how we go. Okay, so I've got the controls the wrong way around. Let me just fix some, fix some stuff up here very... Oh, my gosh. Alright, the controls are the wrong way around. Let me just fix this up very quickly. Alright. You've really given me a, a balls game today there, Joseph, just so you know. I love you, bro, but Jesus. Alright, let, let's see what you got for me, Joseph. I can't even hit that bird! Alright, let's go. <clears throat> How you going, Joey? Good to see you. Oh, not much, man. We're just playing some Earthworm Jim on the old Sega McMaster system. Uh, and, and we're shooting a fridge now. Uh, how am I supposed to shoot my gun? Okay, we can't get the fridge. Uh, is that some health? Alright. So, Alex says he couldn't get past this level. Uh, I think that's going to probably be you and me both, mate. Probably you and me both. Nine hours of paradise, man. I hope you get through it really... Uh, fuck, God, e, mate. I hope you get through it really quick, Cruz. We'll see you again uh, in the evening, man. We'll be on all night. Okay, I've... Oh, dude, I don't even... Man, this is even worse than the Sega G G Mega Drive version, D-Wayne. Just, just before you think I give you all the hard requests, bro. Just, just before you think that. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not. Yeah, yeah. So someone on someone from Brazil thought this was a great idea. I mean, you know what? I respect that my Brazilian friends for putting Mortal Kombat on like the Master System. I think they put Mortal Kombat two, uh, three on the Master System. But I don't know, Seeker. Your brothers and sisters have got some explaining to do on this one. Uh, now, where are we supposed to go? 
Oh no, Seeker's awake yet. She might be sleeping. We're gonna, um, alright. I don't, I, don't, I don't know where to go. Let's just, where do you go, my son, bish? Can we, can we climb up this, uh, I don't, I don't, okay, I think I was going the right way. You think this is just as hard as Vector Man? Dude, I would rather play Vector Man. <laughs> oh my, oh my gosh, I can't. Ah! Evan! Good to see you, Evan. Am I supposed to jump up these things? Oh, so you're supposed to climb up that. Well, how the hell's a brother supposed to know you're supposed to go up that way? Oh, come on! Like, really, was I supposed... Man, I... Oh, dude, you... You fucking cooling me? These backgrounds are just all blending in with each other. Oh, mate. I, I actually liked, uh, I played Vector Man 1 and 2 on whatever Wednesday, and I thought the second one was a bit more fun and forgiving. The first one, uh, if I never played it again, I'd be quite okay with that. Alright, alright, well then we made it. You feel like this game could suit a remaster? I tell you what, if they remastered this, it couldn't be worse than the original. You think Seeker is either sleeping or laughing? She's probably laughing in her sleep. <laughs> Alright. Hey, how you going, Jory? How did Peter eat it last night go? Believe it or not, I actually won this week. That was something a little bit different, girl. Thank you for coming back in. Yeah, no, we, we ended up we ended up winning. And uh yeah, no, we did alright. We we did okay, my friend. Fuck I'm kinda of running low on health here. I'm a little little stressed out. How you do? How how'd you go, Jory? How's the how's your how's your day starting off? They put this version of the game on Game Gear too. Yes, that's, that's, that's just blasphemy, isn't it? All right, we're gonna go back up here. This is really the same as the 16-bit version. It's not a whole lot different. Were we supposed to get another Earthworm Jim? For the love of God, I'm glad we didn't. All right, so we're gonna keep going over here. All right, back over on this side. Then, yeah, I know, you, you like the little angel on my shoulder, what can I say? Alright, can we do a big run jump over here? No? Well, that's not going to cut the mustard, is it? Where am I supposed to get up from there, then? How am I supposed to... Oh, wait, I've got to whip with my tail, don't I? Like that? Can, can you whip up? Can you, maybe I can... Okay. Well, where am I supposed... I don't know what to do. Oh, this is stupid. Lauren says, poor Ricky. I know. See, I, I didn't want to. I didn't want to bestow this on my poor friend D Wayne today. So, okay. So that's that's definitely not where we go. Or is it? I don't know, man. Oh, dude. I'm I'm sorry to hear. Jory says you didn't sleep too well. Oh, you're sitting at the essential office job waiting for your lunch and playing on your phone. You finished all your work in the first hour. Well, hey, you know what? At least that's something, hey? So, how, what, how we get up there? I don't even know where to go now. This is a... I don't know where to go. I, I can't get up on that platform. Can, can you see what to do, D-Wayne? Yeah, I, th I think, you know what, I think if Joseph's taught us something today, Joseph, I think Earthworm Jim is now going to go on the permanent ban list, my friend. And this is about to get the five minute treatment. <laughs> I can't do this anymore. <laughs> oh my god. I feel really bad for turning that off too because Joseph does so much of the page, but that game was killing me. <laughs> oh my gosh. Joseph, I love you, brother. I can't do what you... <laughs> Joseph is like, do what you must. All right, you know what? I'm going to make it up to you, Joseph. I'm going to give Joseph a free hot dog dance. I'm going to give Joseph a free... Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to do Joseph a free hot dog dance. And I'm going to beg for mercy by being his dancing clown. Alright, here we go. 
I'm a hot dog. I'm a hot dog. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Yeah, the, yeah, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, thank you so much, brother. That that was just something else. <laughs> Jory dropping the 100 stars. Jory, this is for you. Thank you very much. Joseph says, okay, you're forgiven. All right, great. There you go. We, we, came, to, we came to an agreement. See, all things can be worked out. All right. Hey, how you been keeping, Donny? The next game we've got is for Sky, aka Steven. And he's picked Point Blank 2. Now, he wanted the PlayStation version. But I did pick the arcade version because it's easier to play with the mouse. And I thought it might be a more uh, uh, enjoyable run. I didn't think you would mind, uh, sir. So, uh, Sky, hopefully you enjoy the replay, my friend. Let's see, see how we go with Point Blank 2. Oh, gosh. Thank you once again, Jory. Jory with a massive hundred stars. Appreciate you very, very much, my friend. We're going to we're gonna uh, insert some coins of them, y'all. Yeah? Josh says you hope I will. Yeah, dude, I'm doing great. Oh, it's actually... It's it's a Guitar Hero Live model on the PS4. It's not a real guitar, Jory. My, my roommate's a guitarist. He's got real guitars. Uh, but no, we're just going to do this for... Um, no, it's not a real guitar. It's a guitar hero guitar. Hey, you going, Pat? Good to see you. Well, let's see how we go on this bad boy, huh? <laughs> Brian says one day you're gonna overdo the hot dog dance and hurt yourself. Well, until that, until that day. So we're gonna get 26 or more targets here. Oh wait, we, oh wait, we're not supposed to shoot the doctors. All right, well that's not good. Probably gonna fail this one, guys. This one's actually a bit tricky. How many did we get? 16. Geez, that was hard. Oh, let's try again. Oh, well, we lost a heart, but that's alright. How many of you guys played point blank back in the day? Let's let's try this one over here. As I said, this is really hard to play without the light gun. Shoot 45 or more windows. Well, damn, let's go. This is this is this is like like a, a parlor shooter game, you know, kind of like a shooting range game. Oh, so we're just gonna shoot as many windows as we can. I mean, that's pretty straightforward, and anyone can do that. This is no problem. I, I this is this I can handle. Beyonce, can you handle it? Becky, can you handle it? One coin, can you handle it? I don't think you can handle it. All right, there we go. I'm hoping I got enough. How many windows did I get? I cleared. There we go. I got 45. That was freaking lucky, wasn't it? All right, so we're just gonna do a tower here. What's this some bitch one? What, what's this some sucker one? Right, we'll, we'll do this one over here. So we gotta hit 25 targets. We're gonna shoot fireworks. All right, well we'll give it a go. We got one more shooter after this, guys, and it's Lethal Enforcers 2, the arcade game for for Ryan, I think. Oh look, it stars. All right, there we go. Bakuru, excuse me. All right, let's go. Here we go. One coin. Here we go. Uh, uh. Here we go. One coin. Here we go. What's this one? Failed. Well, that's no good. No lethal enforcers two is next, Lauren. Is this Duck Hunt? No, but it's a very similar game to Duck Hunt. Same kind of sh shtick. All right. We're so all right. We're gonna go this one over here. It's all right. So hard with the mouse. Shoot all of the targets. All forty-five, huh? All right. Gonna get 45 of the sunbishes. Let's go. We've got 15 seconds. Let's go. Oh, okay. Dude, I can't get that many that quick. I'm gonna start getting carpal tunnel. So we're gonna get every single one. Oh my gosh, they're not quick enough, mate. Oh, dude, that was close. Damn. Payron says no soup for me. It's a lot this is actually a lot harder than the original one. 
Oh gosh. All right. So what's? Oh, there's a one up. There's an insane one up here. Let's see what this is. Insane, hey? These are already hard enough for me. Oh, we got to shoot all the freaking criminals. All right, we're gonna shoot the dirty freaking drug dope dealers. All right, let's go. Yeah, pretty close. Close, but no cigar, as they say. All right, shoot all the. Oh, okay, there's a lot of them, isn't it? Shoot all the criminals. Fuck, man. I'm... Bro, how quick do you think I am? Oh my gosh. I wonder if you get rapid. Do you get? Do you have to keep clicking, or do you get? Wow. All right, no worries. We're gonna have to put in another credit. All right, we're gonna save old freaking Doctor Chaos over here. Keep the sharks away. This is this is point blank number two. All right, we'll keep the sharks away. All right, stay away, you dumb ass sharks. All right, there we go. That's one. That's two. Stay away, dickhead. Uh, all right. Oh, well, that didn't really work out. He just got eaten by Jaws game over. Fuck, I suck at this. I'm sure Sky's laughing his absolute titties off right now. It's all good. I would be too, mate. If I was watching someone else suffer like this, I'd be also be laughing. All right, let's put in another credit. All right. Shoot, shoot 24 or more birds. All right. <laughs> okay, this will be over soon, Rick. This will be over soon and you can relax. Yeah, I tell you what, some of these, you know, most of the games on the list today were pretty decent. But even the good ones are pretty tricky. Alright. Oh, we're going to watch out for the bombs, mate. Oh, dude, I, I can't. What, did I get enough of them? I failed to Oh, my gosh. Jory says, oh, Ricky, I meant to ask last night, how'd you select which games will end up on the wheel for Beat It or Eat It? Uh, yeah, no, I answered that actually to someone else. I'll answer again for you. Um, so basically, I just know what retro games I've got experience with and kind of know my ability level. And that's the best way to pick the challenges. So I sometimes pick, based on what I know of my ability, some games challenges that are easy, some are hard, and then some that are about 50-50. So that, that's pretty much all there is to it. Oh, here we go. D Wayne says this game's a wonderful journey in Pew Pew. <laughs> it is. Oh, we got a bonus stage. Well, that's good. Find the bonus life. Don't mind if I do. So Tommy says you like beat it or eat it. Yeah, today's show was a little bit flat, just because it wasn't as close as last week. Hopefully next week will be a bit better. Well, there we go, we just got the extra life, guys. Yeah, of course, Jory. Jory's like, thanks, Randy. You're so polite, but you think I'm some kind of snob or something? There's no Sunbish army with, without the awesome people watching. Of course I'm going to answer you, Jory. Well, your poor Jory thinks she's going to ask a question and Rick's going to go, Fuck, fighty, fuck. Well, actually, sometimes I do. Okay, scrap that. So sometimes I do have a bit of a bad attitude. But hey, but you know what? What can I say? My bark is worse than my bite. There we go. We got him. That's it. Oh, goodness. Oh, I'm just going back over here. Big thank you once again for hanging out, guys. Don't After this game... We have still got Lethal Enforcers too. Oh, what's a car one? Let's have a look at this. This looks interesting. This one looks interesting. What's this one? Shoot the car 40 times to destroy it. Alright, so I'm going to... Okay, this is... I'm going to have to... Alright. So I'm going to do a little magic trick here. Oh, how many times did I get it? Oh, only 16 times. We all freaking shoot, mate. There you go. I, I guess that, that was a hard... Fuck. I guess that's a hard challenge for a reason. Just ask Ricky to add... Yeah, pe pe people forget that I'm not a freaking machine, don't they, John? I think people start to think I'm the T-1000, to be honest.
Oh, no, no, I totally get it. I totally... Oh, damn, I wasn't paying attention. No, as someone that's been in the entertainment industry for a long time like you, I totally get it. Come on, Rick. Oh, there you go. Rick, blow some bombs up. It's all fine. Not doing too well this time round, am I? There you go. So, did I pass? Hey, we got it! So, when is the Earthworm Gym going on the wheel so we can have it twice a week? I am not doing Earthworm Gym on the wheel ever, ever, ever. Look, look at what you've started, Joseph. Do you... Look at what you've started, Joseph. Yeah, no, John, I know this. And that's why I've got to really try and not let the needy, like, 5% suck the energy out of me. That's something I'm kind of failing with at the moment. But, um, alright, there we go. Did I win? No, I failed. Shoot the can to keep it airborne. It would, it would have been nice if I read the challenge before I did it. And Joseph says, I did not start. No, you're right, you didn't. Poor Joseph. You're right, that was a bit unfair of me to blame you. Well, what was this one? Alright, we've got another couple challenges here. John says it's Bayou Billy Band. Yup! Yup! I am going to release a list of band games very, very soon. <laughs> for one, for one point only, whatever Wednesday. Surprisingly, uh, Superman 64 is not banned. I don't hate that game enough to ban it. It does get the five minute treatment though. I love the music in this level. Got the typical 90s soundtrack here, don't ya? Did I win? 30 criminals, I only got 22. You really like Bayou Billy? That was one of the games I kind of liked in my childhood and actually played a lot, and then... When I play it now as an adult, I can't believe I was actually interested in it. Alright, we need to do some maths problems. Let's do some maths problems, everybody. Shoot correct answers, alright. Do I see one coin ever including an exclusive sports game streamer? Well, as I said, if anyone was going to do the sports game, Steve, it'd be me. But the reason I don't do the sports games uh, is they don't often give a lot of... Gr well, put it this way. We're going to test the waters, Steve. So when the new Tony Hawk game comes out, when the new NBA game comes out, when the new Formula One game comes out, when the new NASCAR game comes out, uh, and all that kind of stuff, I'll try them out and we'll see what works. So uh, I don't know if it'll ever be a permanent thing. Oh wait, I was supposed to click the answer, not quite. Okay, sorry. I wasn't paying attention, all right. Totally screwed that one up, didn't I? I totally failed that, I know I did. You're doing Blitzball on Friday's VIP? Are you really? Oh, NFL Blitz, you mean? Gotcha. Back to game, yeah. <laughs> so, Mikey says, I love you, but you're supposed to be a man of the people. Ah. Oh. Hey man, what can we say? One coin only is a fake democracy. We're really a dictatorship. You know, it's like a matter of do as I say, not as I do, sir. Thank you very much. Shoot the red. I'm trying to shoot the red here. Alright, we're almost done. As I said, there's 16 levels, so there's going to be like a, two more levels left after this, I think. And then, then we can uh, say au revoir to this bad boy. I think you guys will like the final game. How you going, Joseph? Good to see you. Thank you for hanging out. Welcome, welcome. Damn, I only missed one. I'm not passing any of these today. As I said, the big problem is just playing this with a mouse. It's really, really tough. Alright, so then we're going to save the, the professor one more time. Alright, two more levels left, guys. Oh, i got to turn this off. My bad. Alright, hit the target with one shot. Alright. Hit the target with one shot. We're going to try. 
Where's the tar? Oh, here we go. That's not hard. That's easy. There we go. We saved him. So Ryan says you've only seen anyone get banned when they've absolutely deserved it. Oh. There's, um... The, you know what my biggest pet hate on the channel is? Like, um, I want to be there for people who have a tough time. But when you've got, like, people coming in, like, every day for two years, constantly complaining about their life, uh, then you know it's kind of the problem's them, and they're trying to bring the chat down. I absolutely hate that, because, you know, most people that watch have their own struggles and uh, things that they're going through, and when certain people come in and try and suck the energy out of them, I, I can't handle that shit. That's, that's just... Yeah, that's kind of where I draw the line, so... I kind of silently hit the band hammer on those kind of people sometimes, too. You only had, like, four seconds to shoot that target? Yeah, tell me about it. Alright, so that's all done. You're hopeless. Learn to aim. Yeah, that's, that seems about right. At least I'm not hopeless. Okay, at least at least I didn't get ranked hopeless. All right, well that one was no. But as I said, guys, it's no, nothing wrong with going through a struggle. You know, we want to be here for you guys. I'm not talking about that. Don't misunderstand me. I'm talking about the people that come in and they're just like, "Oh, life sucks. I hate my life. I don't want to be here." Just every single day for two years, like that shit don't fly. All right, we're gonna do our final game now. And uh, this game is going out to uh, Ryan, Lethal Enforcers 2. Ryan, thank you again for your request. Hopefully we do well on this one. How you going, Jeremy? Good to see you. Thank you for coming in. I really appreciate you. Hope you're doing well, Jeremy. Having a good break. <clears throat> yeah, do you even aim, bro? Okay, so this is Lethal Enforcers 2. As you guys know, the first Lethal Enforcers was a Cops and Robbers game. This one, this uh, Lethal Enforcers 2 is a uh, Spaghetti Western. So, uh, yeah, a lot of... Oh, crap. Well, let's go. Oh, okay, innocent victim. He can't be in that is innocent. So we got to shoot off the screen. All right. I love the music in this, it's pretty cool, huh? They're like, like little outlaws and stuff. I think this is cool. Let's see you shoot, I'm trying. Again, this is really hard with a mouse instead of a gun. You know, because you need instant reflexes. Oh gosh. We got him. Couldn't tell if that was an innocent or not. I wonder if there's any hookers up here. I wonder what's going on in this little saloon. You remember playing this at the arcade? I think I played the second one on the arcade. Now, this was actually on the Sega Genesis. So I remember Lethal Enforcers 1 was on Genesis over here. I don't know if Lethal Enforcers 2 got released in Australia or not, actually. Maybe you guys in the UK can let me know if this was a PAL game or not. But I don't remember this one as a kid. I only remember the first one. Oh, damn. Uh, see, I'm just getting smashed. Oh, dude, see? I'm, I'm trying to see. It's a hard game to read. Oh, my gosh. This, this is definitely a hard game to read comments on. I'm not shooting. All right, we'll stop getting in the way, then. another credit. I can't believe I've lost a whole credit already. <laughs> I am so freaking horrible at these games. I'm not really putting on much of a show today. Hopefully I do Hopefully I do a bit better in then tonight's, huh? As I said, sorry if I've butchered your request today, guys. I've really given it my best. Some of, some of these games are just really hard. It's alright. It is what it is, huh? 
Oh, there you go, take that. Where are you going? Alright, he's... Oh, we've got a chain ball, that's fun. Is that like rapid fire? It better be. Well, there we are. Well, oh, look, I just crotch shot him. That's the one. Oh, okay, I've run out of chain gun. That's... Oh, where are you going, Mr. Bush Ranger? I'm looking for the Kelly gang. You think I'd make Chuck Norris proud? I hope so. Chuck Norris is my hero. So, so this was also a PAL game in the UK. Okay, so lethal and force of the case. I just never saw it at the video store or nothing. I would have loved this, man. I love cowboys and Indians. <clears throat> okay, so what we got over here... Alright, well he's got some cannons. Look, it looks like... Oh, okay. This, this guy's getting a bit trigger happy on me. This is, this is definitely very... He, he's, pro he's probably defending the snake oil salesman behind... Oh my gosh. He's, he's probably... There's probably the snake oil salesman around the back that he's defending to that. Oh, could he? Jeez. Oh my goodness. Oh boy. Oh boy, boy, boy. Oh, we got him. Alright, that's level one. They don't just say they don't want to die, but they run right in front of the guys with the guns. I oh, know, that makes no sense. Like, none. <laughs> yeah, this was on Sega Genesis too. Alright, so we're gonna do another level here. Oh, see, I'll. On the horses, it's a bit... Oh, there you go. Okay, I, I wasn't supposed to shoot the, the guy. Okay. My bad. Now there's no one riding the carriage. What the hell are you doing there with your little horn, dickhead? Nice shooting, Tex. It wasn't that great. Oh, okay, you got to put another credit in. That's alright, we got plenty of credits. Where I come from, we get unlimited credits. Do you really love this? It's a realistic tin star? I don't think I know what tin star is, actually. You might think I'm crazy for not knowing what that is. Where are you going? Where are you going, mate? There you go, got him, got him. Oh. da 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 Oh, I'm not shooting at you, woman. Get back in there. Why, why don't you stay ducked down and we won't be having these problems? Oh, my gosh. It's pronounced... Oh, pronounced Tinder. I, I, I wonder what they used to do back in these days instead of swiping left. I, I think they swiped left and right still, but just at the top floor of the saloon, if you know what I'm saying. Oh, gosh. You hope these horses know where they're going. I, I don't know what... I don't think they... Oh, there you go. Get away! Oh, my gosh. There's some slow-flying arrows, aren't they? There, there's some slow... Oh, my gosh. He got me. All right. We, all right. Is that it? Is that the end? All right. We're out of here. That was a cool level. And now what? Is this, is this a boss? Okay. Boss time. Keep those barrels away from me, punk ass. Nice. Okay, this, this boss is a little bit easier than the last one. Oh, dude. Okay, I'm trying to reload the gun. He won't let me. I right, got him. All right, boom. There goes the dynamite, my friends. So how many bottles are we supposed to shoot? All of them, I guess. Oh, well, that didn't really work out, did it? Okay. So, Nixon, Rixon, good news. Finally, you won a grill at the local liquor store. Oh, so what? You actually, like, won, like, a barbecue? Is that what you mean? Like a barbecue grill? 
That is cool. How'd you enter the draw for that? That's neat. How'd you do that? There you go. You can shoot the bottles on there. You know what I'd love to play for you guys one day on the Nintendo Wii, but it's not that good? I'd love to get a copy of Mad Dog McCree. Who remembers Mad Dog McCree? I think if you get Mad Dog McCree on the Wii, it's got like... Mad Dog McCree and the sequel and another game or something on it, doesn't it? Do, do you guys know the game I'm talking about? It's that uh, Laserdisc game. That real life cowboy game that used to be in all the arcades back in like... Uh, 1992, 93. You know the one I'm talking about, right? It'd be cool just to put on for like five minutes as a gimmick. Because you're not going to really get much more time out of it. Ricky the Rifleman. I'm just getting my ass handed to me today, man. As I said, this was not designed to be used with a mouse. Hey, go on there, Tommy. Good to see you. So I just don't have the reflexes today. You don't, you don't remember Mad Dog McCree? Also, Mike says you liked... Yeah, that was on the... Yeah, that was on the, the Sega CD as well. But it was really grainy on that. Yeah, still drunk, you feel... I'm good on you, dude. You gotta be in it to win it, hey? You know what they say. I'm happy for you, dude. Alright, well... Fortunately, that... Uh, Damn it, man. I can't move that quick. Where are you going, whoa, at? What's, what's that What's that thing down here? Oh, it's like some... Oh, I just shot... I wasn't sure if she was a good guy or not, because she was a pretty lady. Alright. Oh, that's all done. Oh, my gosh, dude. <laughs> I haven't shot sideways. Alright, so I'm going to do the boss on this level, and then that will be the end of the stream. Oh gosh, get him. Thank you, Gerardo. I'm glad you're liking it. This is a... Oh, crap. Alright, he's a big, big... He's like... Jeez, man. Oh, now, now we got the good guns here. That's kind of cool. Alright, I see where you... Oh my gosh. This game is definitely a quarter muncher. It's a Konami game. What do you expect? Oh no, I see. I got you, Jerry. You know, I, I you know, um, my my auntie and I were looking at getting a Sega CD back in 1992. Obviously, I'm not going to pay for it back then. I didn't have any money, but we were looking at getting one for the home. And I remember we went to the Toy World uh, in on the Gold Coast. And I think the only game they had on display at the time for the Sega CD was like the crappy NXS game. And then she was like, yeah, no, nah, we're not paying $600 for this. And I was like, yeah, I wasn't that upset about it either. Did anyone actually get the Sega CD and was really happy to have it as a kid? Like, honestly? Like, did, did you guys ever get a Sega CD and feel like you got your money's worth out of it? Why am I hurting the lady? She just wants some nookie, man. I know. She just wants some fun with Uncle One Coin. Sounds so creepy when I say it like that, doesn't it? <laughs> oh, we got it. Ah, oh, damn. Come on, get... I think we're almost up to the, the boss of this level, guys. Should be in the next screen, hopefully. Oh, no, is it one of the... Okay, well, I didn't realise he wasn't on my team. Probably... Maybe I could shoot this sign. No, I can't. I, I'm trying to shoot as many objects as I can because they... Oh, my gosh, they sometimes have guns. Oh, gosh, brah! Yeah, I guess, I guess we forget how, like, a, a ahead of its time it was, I suppose, to a point. Like, what does not seem impressive at all now? Like, even now, I look back at some PlayStation 1 games and I'm not impressed by it. Alright, so now what are we going to do? What do you draw or shoot? Oh, how am I supposed to do this? How, how am I supposed to do this with a mouse? I can't do this with a mouse. Are you freaking kidding me? One more time. I can't do this with a mouse. 
Oh, dude. No, I'm going to try one more time. This might be where I'm stuck. Oh, dude. It's so close. One more. All right, one more time. Come on. Oh, fuckity. Really? Can I just shoot them all early? I'm going to see if I can shoot them all early. Screw you. Fuckity, dude. All right, now that's it. I'm done. Fuck, I can't do that level with a fucking mouse. <laughs> oh my gosh okay that's where I'm going to get stuck but that's okay we got three good levels out of that oh my goodness that was really really interesting guys what a you can do <laughs> I can't do it because I'm using a mouse on a fucking gun do you mean ah alright guys that was the very very first episode of uh, whatever Wednesday thank you for watching guys we have had some uh Interesting games there. Thank you to everyone who made a request. Uh, guys, don't forget, if you want to make a request as well, you can enjoy that perk, plus many more things by clicking on the green shield. And uh, no pressure, guys. That's just an option for you. Uh, I'm going to do some work and then head to bed. Uh, but uh, D Wayne's going to be back on soon. And uh, I'm going to be back on later in the day. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys all enjoyed the show. And uh, enjoy the start to your day, guys. If you're still looking for some content, hang tight. I'm about to play the outro. And uh, I will uh, s send you to another stream. So take care of yourself, everybody. And uh, I'll see you again soon. Take care, guys.